your mom has no right to interfere in your wife's lifestyle. She has no right to tell you or to dictate upon you that she must not go to the restaurant except once a month, that she should not see her parents' house except once a week for half an hour or less. She should not spend the night there. This is none of her business. And you will be sinful if you obey your mom or obey your father in such issues. Unfortunately, in so many countries, especially in the subcontinent, and I don't know why is, this is the case. Maybe it's from the Hindu heritage or something. I don't know. The daughter-in-law is treated as a servant. So when I marry, I marry a woman who my mom is pleased with her submission and obedience to her. And once we get married, she becomes the servant of the house. She's obliged to cook clean and do all the chores while the sisters-in-law in -law and the mother-in-law are resting and just supervising. And this is haram. This is injustice. Part of being dutiful to your parents is not by marrying a free woman and making her a slave to them. This is not at all kind of being dutiful. So a man has to become a real man in knowing how to stop his wife from interfering with his relationship with his parents' affairs. And he has to know how to stop and prevent, diplomatically that is, respectfully, his parents from interfering in his marital life and in his wife's lifestyle.